নমস্কার শুভ সন্ধ্যা কলেজ শিক্ষক সংস্থার মাননীয় সভাপতি মহোদয় মাননীয় সম্পাদক মহোদয় যাট মন্ডলের কেন্দ্রীয় সমিতির মাননীয় সদস্য বৃন্দ যাট মন্ডলের সভাপতি আর সম্পাদক মহোদয়কে প্রমুখ্য করে বিভিন্ন বিষয়ের বাবে মন্ডলের কার্যনির্বাহক আগ ধরবা সদস্যবৃন্দ শ্রদ্ধার বিভিন্ন কলেজর মহোদয় মহোদয়া সকল সকল মূর শ্রদ্ধা জ্ঞাপন করছো আজি এগারো ফেব্রুয়ারি এই বিশেষ দিনটির তাৎপর্য রাখি বাহনা মহাবিদ্যালয়ে অনুষ্ঠিত করা শ্লোগান প্রতিযোগিতার অংশগ্রহণ করা প্রতিযোগী সকল সকল মানে মরম জানাই আজ আন্তরাষ্ট্রীয় বিজ্ঞান আর প্রযুক্তির ক্ষেত্রে নারীর বিশেষ ভূমিকা লক্ষ্য রাখি এই দিবসটি উদযাপন করা হয় দিবসের সংগতি রাখি বাহনা মহাবিদ্যালয়ের বায়োটেক হাবে যি সুন্দর চিন্তার শুভ কাম এটি অংশগ্রহণ করবল আমাকে সুবিধা প্রদান করলে সেই সুবিধা প্রদান করার বাবে মানে যাট মন্ডলের ওমেন সেলর কনভেনর হিসাবে তখেসলের ওর কৃতজ্ঞতা তথা ধন্যবাদ জ্ঞাপন করছো ইয়ার পাশের কার্যসূচী চলাই যাবর যাট মন্ডলের সভাপতি মহোদয়ক মানে আহ্বান জানাইছো কিছু সহায় হওয়াক মানে যুক্ত কার্যসূচী তৈয়ার করছিল এই আসন অলঙ্কৃত করে আজ এই কার্যসূচী আগবাই নিবল অনুরোধ জানাইছো ধন্যবাদ ধন্যবাদ যাট মন্ডলের মহিলা কোষর জড়িয়ে বাহনা মহাবিদ্যালয়ের উদ্যোগত আজি অনুষ্ঠিত এই যে শ্লোগান প্রতিযোগিতা বা বিজ্ঞান আর নারীর সম্পর্কের ক্ষেত্রে যারনেসর যে আজ কার্যসূচী হাতত লওয়া হয়েছে এই সচাক এটা অতি গুরুত্বপূর্ণ পদক্ষেপ এই গুরুত্বপূর্ণ পদক্ষেপ যখন উদ্যোক্তায় উঠি পড়ি লাগিছে তখন শুভেচ্ছা জানাই মানে আজি এই কার্যসূচী চলাই যাবর আগবাড়ি আর আপনার সকরে সহায় সহযোগিতা বিচারি আমার মাজত মই দেখি আমার অসম কলেজ শিক্ষক সন্থার মাননীয় সভাপতি মহোদয় সুষম সম্পাদক মহোদয় আর মহিলা কোষর আমার যাক উদ্যোগ উদ্যোক্তা আছে আমার মাজত আহি উপস্থিত হব গতি সকলকে মানে শুভেচ্ছা জানাই আজ এই গোটাই কার্যসূচী মানে আরম্ভ হয়েছে আর এই গোটাই কার্যসূচী সুচারুপে পরিচালনা আপনার সহযোগিতা হব বলে মানে আশা রাখি ধন্যবাদ উদ্বোধন করবর আমি কলেজ শিক্ষক সন্থার মাননীয় সভাপতি মহোদয়ক নিমন্ত্রণ জানাইছিল গতি আজ আমার মাজত সভাপতি মহোদয় শ্রীযুত হিমাংশু মরল ডাঙরিয়া দেব উপস্থিত আছে uh jorat zone cta uh, i am really uh, grateful to all of you especially the women cell of jorat zone assam college teachers association uh, who has taken the pain to organize such a beautiful competition uh, in collaboration with uh, the bio institutional biotech hub of bahana college uh, on the occasion of uh, international uh, day of women uh, girls and women in science and technology So it is a very relevant topic in present context. 
and i am really thankful to my dear colleagues of jura zone especially the uh, women members of women cell cta uh, for taking this initiative i sincerely hope that uh, the slogan competition slogan writing competition that has been organized on all india basis by our organizational wing that is women cell jura zone uh, it will it will it will go a long way to to spread awareness among the students of uh, india regarding uh, the role and the place uh, of women and girls in science and technology uh, given the given the given the fact that uh, we uh, indians we indians are basically being uh, members of a society with 5000 years of civilizational continuity uh, sometimes this uh, long civilizational continuity uh, actually reflects in a negative way by 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 maintaining some conservative uh, conservative traditions which are uh, which are not conducive for the development of uh, women and girls in society since uh, women forms a uh, 50% of the population until and unless we are able to bring women and girls child at par with the rest of our society we cannot hope for a developed nation we cannot hope for a better india so this is a very relevant topic topic not only in the context of the world but uh, especially for india since we are striving to be one of the global players in economy in science and technology and in, in sports space everywhere medical science so uh, i'd like to cite one example uh, as you know uh, till recently the sex uh, the sex ratio between men and women in some of the states of north india uh, is uh, appalling uh, naturally speaking uh, god maintains nature maintains a balance 50% balance between male and female population but uh, due to female uh, uh, infanticide in most of uh, most of the northern states uh, what we have uh, found that uh, the girl student uh, girl girl child ratio has fallen drastically <coughs> so this is a taboo in uh, our traditional indian society that girl child is, uh, is, is 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 a burden economic burden on the on the family uh, but the scientific reason uh, for which uh, a children is a boy or girl that was not understood by the people it is it is the male it is the father who is responsible who carries the y chromosome and due to the y chromosome uh, the sex of the child is determined to be male but the blame for the birth of girl child is put on the mother so this is something this is something which is very scientific and if this scientific information is spread in the society that if at all if at all girl child is born it is not the mother but the father is responsible and if the father is responsible it is his duty the duty of the paternal society to protect the girl child so this is uh, some kind of information uh, some sort of information which will help us to overcome the social evil with the help of uh, science and technology so another 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 aspect of uh, our society is that uh, the taboo associated with uh, monthly monthly cycle in most of the temples of south india uh, and rest of the rest of the rest of the country it is considered a taboo so what wh- what is taboo what is taboo about it uh, why should we be concerned about something which is the creation of god so if we are able to uh, spread awareness in the society regarding all these issues associated with women and girl child Uh, which have uh, prevented the girl child and women from becoming equal member of the society from marching uh, equally with the male members of the society and then we will not be able to uh, uh, visualize the vision of our founding fathers of india founding fathers of the nation to to see india as a developed state to see india as a vishwaguru to see india uh, leading the world in economy in science in space in medicine in sports and all other spheres of life so i i am i'm grateful to to the to the jorhat zone and to the uh, women cell acta assam police teachers association jorhat zone uh, for organizing such a beautiful program for organizing uh, this slogan competition and i am i'm hopeful i am i am hopeful and confident that this initiative will 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 encourage the other other associations and other other members of the society to to spread awareness regarding the equal rights of uh, women and girl child in society with the help of science and technology so with these few words 
I declare this uh, webinar uh, held to commemorate the uh, International uh, Girls and Women's uh, Day in Science and Technology uh, to be open. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Moral, for your very relevant speech. Now I request Dr. Songita to elaborate the program and uh, uh, about this, um, uh, few, um, uh, please tell about a few words about this program. Okay. Thank you so much, sir. Respected uh, President SCTA, Central Committee, Himang Shu Moran, sir. Respected President, sir, Jorha Chodel Committee, Dr. Jay Prakash Suza, sir. All the respected dignitaries, teachers, from Assam College Teachers Association who are present here today, and uh, my dear participants who are present on this online meeting platform of Google Meet. As you all know, today is 11th of February, 2023, and this day is internationally, it is celebrated as International Day for Women and Girls in Science and Technology. Uh, it is uh, it's quite obvious that uh, we think that we women are very powerful. We have learned so many things. We have gone so far, but actually the actual scenario is not like that. As our president sir has rightly he has mentioned, what is the present scenario of women in our country? Although we represent the 50% of the whole country's population, but in terms of science, in terms of technology, in terms of uh, uh, contribution towards the human growth and development, our role is really very limited. We are really very, very limited. And that's what we need to understand. And that is why we, are, we all have gathered here to celebrate this day so that we can think of the girls, the women who are growing, who are the next generation of our society so that they can contribute greatly, uh, if not equally, at least to some extent level in our society. So to commemorate this day, I'm really, really thankful to the Jorhat Journal Committee, SCTA, that they collaborated with Institutional Viting Harbor Bahna College. And with their help and support, we organized this slogan uh, writing competition with the team uh, uh, on STEM, Women in Science, Technology, Engineering, and Technology. And uh, I'd like to share a few things regarding this competition. For that, I prepared one word file which I want to share with all of you. So just give me a second. I'm sharing that file. Thank you, Sir, no. Now sir, I'll take some now more. No. Sir, sir, I'd like to take some more time. I just want to show something regarding okay, this competition, okay, okay. sir. So, dear participants, okay, okay, uh, this okay. competition, it was organized with certain rules and regulations, as you can see here, that you should have, uh, you should be a student, that was the first rule. Second rule was that you should have a valid ID card. And the third rule was that one entry against each participant. So, we received all to tell of 40 plus slogans within uh, two and a half days, which, which I really consider is a very good uh, amount of entry. But few entries we couldn't consider as valid because uh, the participant was not a student. Uh, one of our participants was a teacher. And a few of the participants, they did not send their valid ID proof. So these were a few reasons because of which we couldn't consider few of uh, your slogans into this uh, competition. And I want to, wanted to share with a few slogans out of these 40. This first one, it was, uh, uh, it was uh, submitted by Prantu Pratimbora from JB College, Jorhat. You can see the ID proof here also. I'll just quickly scroll. I'll not take much time. Second one, it was from Jawaharlal Nehru Raskio Mahila Mahabhidalaya, Raskio Mahabhidalaya from Port Blair, India. This third one, we couldn't consider it because he did not send the ID proof. Then the fourth one, it was from Pune, Maharashtra. I'll quickly scroll it. Not take well, not this time. Then uh, Parishmita Das from DHSK College, Dibrugor, Assam. She has sent us this beautiful poster uh, along with her slogan. It was really very nice, Parishmita. There is one more uh, student from the same college, Avilakhi Borguhain. Both of them has created this beautiful slogan with her poster. Thank you so much. There are so many, 
Some are from Tamil Nadu, from Pune, one is from Orisha, CV Raman Global University, Orisha. There are many more. Uh, one was from Gualpara, Assam. Then uh, this one was from Coimbatore, time Tamil Nadu. Then from JB College, DCP College. So from all over the country, I would like to say that this competition uh, was quite was a quite successful one. We received so many slogans from different parts of Assam, India, and there is one more that I want to show here. With that, I'll conclude. This is the one that we received from Philippines. Her name was Elisha, Elisha Pumari. She has created this beautiful poster with slogan. So that was quite unexpected. We didn't thought that uh, we will receive something from outside India, also, but we received. And uh, we're really very happy and thankful to all the candidates. So these are a few uh, uh, samples that I have picked out of all those 40 different uh, slogans. And uh, all of those are really very beautiful. I know, dear participants, you are eagerly waiting for the result of this competition. And you know, all these slogans were really very motivating, very innovative. I didn't find any of the slogan on the internet or on Google. I searched myself. And uh, I'd like to congratulate each one of you that you participated and you sent these beautiful slogans to us. So this is just a formality that I, we had to select a, a few of you as for second or third. This is just a formality. So just don't lose your hope and don't think that next time we're not going to participate because this time we didn't win. Because winning is not essential. I think what is essential is uh, participating. And that's what we received, a huge response from all of you. So I'm really, very really thankful to each one of you. And uh, with this, I would like to conclude. Thank you so much, sir. Very beautiful competition. Thank you for Sankita uh, for elaborating the program. Uh, now I request Omar Juti, Omar Juti Bharali, uh, please tell a few words about this competition. Omar Juti. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. I request you as the secretary of the Zorhat John. Okay. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. <clears throat> Good evening, good evening to all of you, respected President Sir of this special online meetings, respected our very respected Honorable President Sir SCTA Assam, Imam Chumal Sir, and all the teachers <coughs> here present here in this online meeting and my dear participants, students, and especially the respected colleagues of ACTL Johar Jun Omen Cell, especially. I would like to provide my thanks to Omen Cell Johar Jun and special thanks to Dr. Sangita Das, the convener of Institutional Biotech Health, Vana College. Uh, the, this innovative idea was first coming from her mind, and she asked me, uh, "Sir, I want to make such type of uh, organize such type of competition. What do you think?" I replied that, "Okay, it's a very good idea, and it will be very innovative uh, activity in our part also. Uh, that's why you just carry on. I'm with you." And only within two or three days, she prepare all the Google form and share everywhere or whatever she can do. And I thank to her once again that I said a pro networking in this area. Uh, that's why so much students from abroad India are also participated in this national uh, slogan competition. Anyway, uh, now I am going to declare the result which the students are very uh, waiting eagerly to know about their result. But uh, before declaring result, I thank each and every student for their uh, participation and for their uh, whatever they do. And all of them are very interesting and very innovative slogan they have right. But uh, uh, sorry to say that it is not possible to get uh, each and everyone the prize, but uh, I assured you all, all of you that uh, we will provide you the certificate of participation 
and the winner also get the certificate of participation and a uh, little money award from our SCTF Jawad June. Uh, the award will be the first prize uh, winner will get 1000 rupees with certificate, every session letter, and second prize um, 700 rupees with certificate and letter of appreciation, and third prize 500 rupees and certificate. Uh, all those things will be uh, provided at due time, and we will ask them um, individually uh, about uh, their contact number or bank details to transfer the prize amount. Uh, first of all, I am going to declare the result. The first prize goes to the student of Sri Krishna College of Technology, Gaurva Pudur, Coimbatore's. Tamil Nadu, Institute of BE, Institutional and Control Engineering. Thank you, Esakas. You got the first prize. And your slogan is Be bold, be bold, be bold to write a girl, child, a gold. Give her knowledge and old, behold. Thank you very much. Very interesting and very innovative. Very, very good. Best uh, slogan and second prize goes to M. A. Elisa T. Punarim Pumarin. She is the student of BSc in Fisheries, College of Fisheries and Ocean Sciences, University of Philippines, Visayas. Congratulations, Elisa, for your innovative slogan. I'm not going to uh, delay uh, everything she write also postering also. I had the main theme of the slogan is let's own our women in STEAM. And already Sangita has uh, shown us the uh, slogan with poster. It is very interesting and very innovative. Uh, congratulations to her also. And third prize goes to Sayanika Dutta, student of DCB Girls College, Johat Assam. She has also write her very interesting slogan in SMS. I would like to uh, read this. Nijasya Poriyahare Isabar Ankare Gorito Poriyalar Komonna Tumar Kaimmo Opotiruddha Sopnare Gogan Mukhi Hoi Orbo Mukhi Bikaf Arusisti Tumaru Lekko. Dhanyavad Swayanika Tumi a Kundar slogan, Niki, Aro, Tito Puska to me, Pato Karakane. I once again, I congratulate all the winners of this competition as well as the all the participants because without participants, it is not possible to select the winner. That's why the participants, all participants are equally important as winner. Uh, thanks to all of you, and I conclude my. Opinion by these few words. Thank you. So I can see you, here this Elisa Pumarin here. Yeah. Uh, so if you permit, can I ask her to share a few words if she was? Yes, definitely, definitely. Yeah. Miss Elisa. Yes, please. Uh, please unmute yourself. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Hello, hi everyone. It is nice. It is nice um, seeing you all virtually. And it is actually my first time joining um, this national slogan competition, and it, it is unexpected that I win. And thank you. And um, and as we celebrate our women's um day and STEM um, we um, it is really an honor to be part of a women to bring change. Thank you. Thank you, Elisa. Thank you. I especially congratulate to all winners and 
best wishes to all participants. Thank you all for all participants. Now I request our PC, our executive member, Dr. Ananta Tamuli, he is present here. I request for a few words from Ananta Tamuli. Ananta? Uh, uh, respected uh, President Sir of, of uh, Jurhat Journal Committee and uh, respected Honorable President of ACTA Central Committee, uh, my colleague uh, Secretary Amorjati Bharali, and respected uh, Bandita Barbara, Dr. Sangeeta Das, and Dr. Dipti Burwa. Actually, I am very extremely sorry for lately joining uh, due to some my busy schedule of the college. Uh, today, Today on the eve of uh, women's and uh, girls in science, uh, uh, this is a very important day for us. Zurhat Jun, Junel Women's Cell and uh, ACTA Women's Cell jointly jointly organized the slogan writing competition. I am very happy to know that sufficient numbers of participants uh, participated in this event. Actually, I am uh, thankful to Dr. Dipti Borua, Dr. Sangeeta Das, and Bandita Barbara for nicely organized uh, this competition, which is definitely encouraged of our students regarding the uh, day of women and, uh, and girls in science um, and various issues of this uh, eve of the day. I congratulate the uh, participants and winners of the uh, competition and with them all a very bright future. Uh, I am very thankful to our President Himangsu Moral uh, for his uh, speech and for his presence and thankful. Uh, I, I also congratulate to all participants once again and thank you to all. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Anato. Thank you. I think Bandita Barbara is also present here. I request Bandita Barbara to few words. Okay. Bandita is present here, no? Hello. Hello. Bandita Barbara is present here. Hello, Oh, sir, they can't. Okay, okay, okay. Tell me, I'm not just a bit of a nice level. Sorry, what is it? Hello? Next, uh, next, then we go to Vutop. Oh, sir, I can eat a tack of how is it now? The two are my home classic cooking, sir. Um, Padok Mohde, the nice left on Greek, take it to the best of Tarabe. Hey, Hoto Aziz in Kuribon Maru, Noibo Paru, into Amar Hukoisa Savile, take a cotato the nice lay. Gotike, speech to the duty bonoile, take a for this sasa, he took a ticket, the nice lay. Aru Bandita Bandita Borbara is a nice lazy ticket, Gorle as a great hippo, Zimandru Paru, Kumambaru, and Eko Kusles, the Duke Conman. Take there, however, I do more space space to have to narrative over into the no very many cases like into it. They can I defend. Okay, then okay. I move a tattoo from this little from this little little from this little. I mean, got to get years later. I mean, a home college kick on our home product. Moholoko 
ধন্যবাদ জানাইছো তখন আমার এটা আনুষ্ঠানিক ভাবে শুভেচ্ছা প্রেরণ করেছে গতি ব্যস্ততার মধ্যে আমার এই প্রগ্রামটির প্রতি সচেতনতা রক্ষা করার কারণে আমি ধন্যবাদ জানাইছো আই রিকুয়েস্ট টু টেক ভোট অফ থ্যাংস ভোট অফ থ্যাংস উইল গিভ ইট গীতা বাইদ স্যার গীতা বাইদ হিমাংশু মরল Respected President Dr. Jai Prakash Oja, Johar Janel Committee. Respected Dr. Sangita Das, Coordinator, Biotech Hub, Bahana College. Respected Secretary Mr. Amon Jyoti Bharali, Janel Committee, SCT, Johar. Dr. Bandita Barbara, Secretary Omin Sel, SCT, Executive Committee. Respected Dr. Deepti Barua, Assistant Secretary, Women's Cell, Juhat General Committee, Assam, all the esteemed colleagues and all the student participants all over the country. Today, all of you know that the, today is International Day of Women and Girls in Science and Technology 2023. In this occasion, SCTA Juhat General Committee along with the Biotech Hub of Bahuna College, organized a national level online slogan writing competition. Today, first of all, I would like to give, the, give my sincere gratitude to the organizing bodies, that is, um, Biotech Hub, Jorhat Bahuna College, and the uh, Jorhat Journal Committee, I would like to give my sincere thanks to the Omicil Johat Committee SCTA, Biotech Hub, Bahana College. Thanks. Next, I am going to give my sincere gratitude to the participants and the winners of national level slogan writing competition. I would like to give my sincere thanks and gratitude to the all the participants as in colleagues of this webinar uh, webinar uh, organized by the uh, journal committee Jorhat and the biotech hub uh, Bahana College. Now, I give my sincere thanks and gratitude to the winners all over the country and especially I give the thanks to our, uh, our students, all of our students, but uh, uh, by, nearly, by my native students, the Prantukoti, and all the uh, students of the DSSK Dibuga College and the uh, DCP Girls College, uh, give my sincere uh, congratulations to all of them. So, at last, I would like to give my sincere thanks and gratitude to all the organizing committee and the opportunities to give me the, this type of this. Um, platform to give my sincere uh, vote of thanks to all of them. So at last, uh, I would finish my vote of thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good ma'am. Thank you. Thank you to all organizers for a such type of beautiful program. Deepti, to me, give a comment. Deepti, give a comment. বিশেষ নাই স্যার সকলকে মানে পুনর্বার শ্রদ্ধা জ্ঞাপন করছো আর স্যার শেষ সামরি আপনার বক্তব্য আজ একটা সুন্দর অনুষ্ঠান আমি উপভোগ করল বাহনা মহাবিদ্যালয়ের বায়োটেক হাবর জড়িয়ে যাট মন্ডলের মহিলা কোষর উদ্যোগত আজি অনুষ্ঠিত এই যে প্রতিযোগিতা এই প্রতিযোগিতাটা আমাকে যথেষ্ট উপকৃত করলে বলে আমি ভাবিব পড়ো আর আমার এই গোটেই ব্যবস্থাটা কলেজ শিক্ষক সংস্থার সভাপতি সম্পাদক 
অসম কলেজ শিক্ষক সংস্থার যাত মন্ডলের আমার যখন কার্যনির্বাহক সকল আমার উপস্থিত থাকি আজি এই সমগ্র কার্যসূচী সাফল্যমন্ডিত করলে আর এইট আমার যাত মন্ডলের একটা প্রথম কার্যসূচী আর এই প্রথম কার্যসূচী সম্পূর্ণরূপে সার্থক হয়েছে গতি একটা সাকসেস প্রোগ্রামের কারণে মানে আমার ইয়ার পার্টিসিপ মানে সকলকে ধন্যবাদ অর্গেনাইজার সকলকে মানে পুনর্বার ধন্যবাদ জানাইছো আর আমি এনেদরে পরবর্তী বা পাশল একটা ভাল প্রোগ্রাম বা অনুষ্ঠান আমি যাতে অনুষ্ঠিত করব পো তার সকলকে মানে আহ্বান জানাইছো আর আজি এই সুন্দর সন্ধ্যাটো আপনার উপভোগ করবলে পাই নিজে ধন্য মানিছো ধন্যবাদ গতি আজি সভা ইমানতে ভঙ্গ হয়েছে বলে মানে ঘোষণা করছো ধন্যবাদ